Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. Listen, we have a special prayer request, and you guys prayed for me. Now, I know a lot of people out there are not interested in prayer, so unfortunately this video may not go very far. But as many of you as can, please share it, because just like you prayed for me when my life hung in the balance, we need to pray for our YouTube family members when their lives hang in the balance. And I want to share this with you, okay? Now, this is, normally I wouldn't name the person, but since they only have letters, I believe it's safe, letters and numbers. I'm just going to na name the letters. This is from PG, our regular family member on YouTube, for Pat's Two Cents. And I want you to hear this. Now, I'm going to read. And I'll try to shuffle some things around so that I can flow. It's not going to be an exact quote, but I'm going to read as much of it as I can. Well, Pat, I want you to know my friend got out of surgery and it went pretty well. She did not have to get a colostomy bag like she thought. They removed most of the tumors. One left a small hole on the vein, but they had specialists in the area on hand and got it under control, as well as the tear in her bladder. That was fixed. She's being removed from ICU now to a room. Okay, now that's going to happen soon, but she's in a lot of pain, a lot of pain, and has a fever that they haven't figured out the cause of yet. So they pl they placed her on antibiotics. Please lift her up in prayer. Please. We are, we praise God for her healing and we rebuke the pain. So we're asking you, praise God for her healing. Declare, decree it, quote the word over her rebuke her fever, say things like, I rebuke her fever in the name of Jesus. I rebuke death in the name of Jesus. I rebuke infections in the name of Jesus and command them to leave her body. All right. Now, uh, please pass this prayer on to your prayer warriors. And thank you so much, my sister in Christ. Her daughter was encouraged when I told her you were lifting her up in prayer. So let's all of us lift her up in prayer because the more the merrier. If one, according to the Bible, if one can put a thousand demons to flight, okay? Ten, could, uh, excuse me, two can put ten thousands of demons to flight. I'm just putting it in everyday terms. So I want you to really pray for her, okay? Um, and I'm going to pray, and I want you to agree with me in prayer. Father, I ask you right now in the name of Jesus to please lift up PG's friend up in prayer. You know she's in the hospital now. You know she's recovering. And Father, we ask you in the name of Jesus to get rid of any and all infections in her body. Give her body warp speed level of healing. And I ask you, Father, for total healing in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord. We bless and praise your name for her life. We bless and praise your name for your mercy. We glorify you, Lord. We magnify you and lift you up. And Father, we rebuke death. We command death to stay away from her. In the name of Jesus, she shall not die. We're quoting the word. She shall not die, but live to declare the works of the Lord, because God has not given her over unto death. Bless her, Lord, with your life, with your breath of life. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Total healing, because healing is the children's bread. And by Jesus' stripes, she was healed. It's already done. We thank you and bless your name, Lord. Amen. God bless you for agreeing in prayer with me and continue to pray for her. You know, when I was in the hospital, that uh, I mean, when I first went in, I was in ICU like she was. 
Uh, I didn't have surgery. I just had procedures. But the doctor told me two and a half weeks ago that when I came, they really didn't think I was going to make it. You guys helped pray me through. And I thank you for that. Pray her through as well. You hear me? God bless you.